What up, Boxer World? Mike Biggs, Boxer. Coming at you with another vid. Yeah, hit that like and subscribe. And hit that bell icon to be notified when I drop this heat. Trout, man. Jamel Charlo. Jamel Charlo has a boatload more skills than Hurd. Facts. Jared Hurd is the only opponent who has stopped Austin Trout since Trout turned pro 12 and a half years ago. The biggest, stronger herd wore down Trout during their fight October 14th in Brooklyn until Trout felt like he couldn't continue. Their, t their scheduled 12-round championship match had been very competitive before Hurd's physically physicality overwhelmed Trout, who was down on all three scorecards when their bout was stopped after the 10th round. Jamel Charlo is bigger than Trout. Two yet, not quite as large as a six foot one heart herd. Charlo stands at five foot eleven, about one and a half inches taller than Trout. Trout won't only face a size disadvantage during their June 9th bout, though. The former WBA super welterweight champ pointed out during a conference call Wednesday that he'll also encounter a much more skillful opponent in the Houston's Charlo than when he challenged her. Jamel, Jamel, Jamel has a boatload more skills, Trout said. In my opinion, Hurd's not very skilled. He's just a big, tough dude, you know. Jamel, he's tough and, you know, he's bigger than most junior welterweights, but he's awfully skilled. So we definitely have got to have have got to worry about his skill set as opposed to him just taking punishment and making me wear down from beating him up. <laughs> That's what happened with her. I just beat him. I just beat him up until I ran out of gas until I couldn't beat him up no more. Come on now. The 32-year-old Trout, 31 and 4, 17 KOs of Las Cruces, New Mexico, suffered from dehydration that night. He challenged her for the, for his IBF junior middleweight, middleweight title at Barclay Center. I was just worn down, and again, I had to go to the hospital for dehydration, which I've never experienced, Trout said. But you know... We were throwing some heat from the first six, seven rounds. And we buzzed him a couple of times. And I felt like just a little bit more worn down. Just a little bit more each round until I had enough, nothing left. And that's when he came on. And the 28-year-old Charlo can successfully defend the WBC Super Welterweight title against Trout, he probably will face her, 22-0, 15 KOs, in an intriguing title unification fight later this year. Heard edged Eris Landy Laura by split decision in his last fight, April 7th in Las Vegas, to retain his IBF title and win the WBA and IBO championships from Cuba's Laura. The Charlo Trout bout will open Showtime's doubleheader June 9th from Staples Center in Los Angeles in the main event, Leo Santa Cruz, 34 and 1 and 1 with 19 KOs of Roseman, Rosemead, California, will defend his WBA Super Featherweight title against Abner Mares in a 12 round rematch. So, yeah, y'all, I mean, those two big fights this weekend, actually, three, you know, you got the, uh, uh, Crawford and Hohen fight too. So uh, yeah, give me your thoughts on that Trout, Trout and Charlo, you know, matchup. You know, in my opinion, I think uh, Charlo gonna stop him because he has he has more skill set. He has more skill set than Hurd. Hurd just a big brawler, man. He just big, tough, come forward fighter, which in my opinion he shouldn't be in. Um, in that weight class, he should bump up maybe two weight class because he a big guy, man. You know what I'm saying? But in that instant, man, I think uh, Charlo will chop her down because Charlo, I mean, because her takes two, way too many shots to the head. And, um, and he leaves his body open for attack, too. So 
Man, we'll just have to see, man, because Charlo is a better skill skill set, has a better skill set than Austin Trout, man. And Austin Trout, man, he's, I think he's at the end of his career, man. So he's more or less a journeyman than um than a contender to me, in my opinion. You know, although Trout still got some skills, still got some gas left in the tank, but if you know if Hurd stopped him in the tenth, I think uh, Charlo will stop him way sooner than that because Charlo's more sharper more technical sound, and, of course, he is the younger guy in the ring. So, you know, we'll just have to see with that, man. We'll just have to see, man. I can't wait. This weekend's going to be a good, good, good weekend for boxing. I can't wait. Jesus Christ. But that's all I got for you guys right now, man. Like and subscribe. Hit that bell icon to be notified when I drop this heat. And, again, yes, I am Mike Biggs Boxing. Holla at your boy. Peace.